Welcome back, guys. If you're not crossover, Mark and Mark here. Let's go straight up all about the Raptors. Ingrid, what do we have? What do we got to talk about? I definitely want to talk about Kawhi. Game, Game seven. seven. Winning shot. What do you guys? What were your thoughts? Before how, the shot was uh, that happened, like, what were? How did you guys feel watching the game? The whole like game seven what was that i was i was nervous because the 76ers were clo were close to the raptors the like almost the whole series yeah so like i was nervous like very nervous for the games and then when in game seven when Kawhi hit that shot it was like relief like they like they they're moving on like because it's it was a hard series was definitely for sure. Like when we were, when me and my like family were watching it, mm -hmm. like everybody, once the shot went up, I found him at, why? <laughs> did you shoot that? Why yeah. did you shoot that? Like <laughs> now we're gonna go into overtime yeah. thinking that, right? Yeah, but, yeah. And then uh, while I was in the air, my whole everybody was like this. Everybody's like standing there like this. And then once they hit the rim, I was like, no, 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 please, please. <laughs> uh, I, I try to use all my force to get it back in. I was like. Mm. <laughs> and, then, and then it somehow bounced back in, yeah. and we were all screaming. It was yeah. crazy. How did you guys celebrate? Like, were you guys jumping yes. on your seat, like your family too? I yeah. ran out of the house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, I think somebody cried in this. Uh, in this, I don't I'm know who it was. Uh, <laughs> that was me. I was crying tears of joy from oh, wow. that. What was your feeling when you saw that go in? So like, when that happened to me, when I saw Kawhi throw in that shot, I'm just like, okay, that was like a good arc. Yeah. I know he, he he's he not the type off. to shoot it that way, so kind of looked off. Like, looked off. He looked off balance. Yeah. So it kind of looked off balance and everything. So I'm just yeah. like, all right, bounce. Bounce again, yeah, and then bounce again. I'm just like, it shot in. Yeah. I was, I don't even know. Like I had the same feeling, like butterflies in my stomach. Yeah, I just couldn't. I had no words to describe how I was feeling. That just like I was so happy that tears actually came. It just came out. Just yeah. came out. Yeah. I don't know. I was so emotionally connected with the with NBA. I don't know yeah. why is it like that with me. So yeah. yeah. <laughs> how did you guys feel when you saw? Um, the Sixers players, like, what yeah, were the things that you guys Joel noticed the most? Yeah, with Joel peeking through from behind the backboard, just yeah. like... I was laughing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to who? Like, Ben Simmons or to... Uh, Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid, yeah. Do you feel like... I was sort of, I was sort of um, sad for him, too. Yeah. Like, I mean, he did cry after yeah. the yeah. 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 yeah, he was crying. Yeah. But in the moment, I was still, I was still happy. Yeah. Do you guys think that was the greatest shot in Raptors franchise history, or like, like NBA well, history? Yeah. Second, 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 second. Do it, second. So. I like the one where Mo Pete threw it up. Oh, like, oh yeah, that was insane <laughs> shot. I, I like that one. That was, uh, this one is on a game seven, like that so NBA yeah. history. Yeah, game winner, game seven. Yeah, it's calling. It I around. mean, it's I mean, it's crazy because yeah. Vin, when like, he shot it, he was like on the ground. Yeah, it was crazy. Like Vince Carter um, had this. It was the same shot. The same shot, like. It was the same moment in game, and yeah. he just shot it, but he missed, he missed and it. Kawhi made it. So I was like, oh my gosh, like. Yeah. 18 years after, right? yeah. redemption kind of thing. Yeah. yeah. Well, so now that now that, that game is over and uh, that propels us to the you know, uh, Eastern the Conference Finals. What were what your thoughts? You guys, what do you guys think about this matchup between the Bucks and, and the Raptors? Like. I think this is definitely game more one, of a challenging. Uh, maybe the game one probably give you guys an idea. What was your thoughts going into game one and how well, when we faced them, what did you guys think after? Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. Kyle Lowry played really good. Finally, Thank right? God. Finally, We've yeah. been waiting for that. Yeah. What, 30 points? Yeah, in game yeah, one? 30, yeah. 30, 30 points. points. And I think he, like, I think he might play, I think he's going to play good in this series. Like, mm -hmm. he might, he might, like, have 20 points a game. Eight, 19 points a game, but like... I'll take that. I'm yeah. fine with that completely. I'll right? take anything b over uh, 10 over points. Over 10 points, yeah, yeah. for sure. Not, not zero points like he had in the yeah. first night. But. Yeah. So what do you guys think of the matchup between Brooke Lopez and Marc Gasol? Brooke Lopez got lucky that night. Got lucky. Yeah. You think so? With yeah. 29 points, you right? You think he yeah. should duplicate that? Like, he was making shots. No, like, like yeah. he was making shots from like 35 feet out. I know. Like, and like... His two shots, like his first three that he took, it wasn't even close. It was so no, I was like, like, so yeah. I thought, oh, he's not gonna, gonna, okay. he's not gonna, he's not gonna be like a big, a, he's not gonna hit threes, lots of threes in this game. But then after three, he's after three, after three, and yeah, but I think it's cool because I know um, the other Gasol's hurt mm -hmm. on, on Milwaukee, but 
it's like the Gasol and Gasol going at it and Curry and Curry going at it. That's, so. Yeah, that's true. That's a big, yeah, I think that's it's awesome. cool. I think yeah. when we were, while I was watching game one, I thought we had a chance. Like mm -hmm. when Giannis was off, yeah. we were up by like, what, 12? He, yeah, and yeah we, we were, had a good 13 point lead. We were too, doing good, and then all of a sudden, Giannis? The Greek freak came out. Just, yeah. just yeah. came out, and then Brooke Lopez started hitting his shots. So I was like, oh, "This is going to be a tough series." Yeah, it was. A, it was really tough during the second half, for it, sure. It was a good game one for us because yeah. usually game one is usually the most hype for the home team, and usually our, you know, the the opposing team would get intimidated or we get blown out. But we put up a good fight, so like you guys said. Like, yeah. do you think game two is going to be the same, or it's going to be a tight game, or I, we're going to get blown out? What's the you know? We have to build the wall. Yeah. yeah, I think that in this series, they just the, in the game, um, in game two, they just have to do the same thing that they did to Giannis in first half, but for the whole game because, like, they were playing, they weren't letting him get into the paint, but they have to. I think that Raptors have to guard the perimeter more better because when mm -hmm. Giannis would attack, everybody would collapse on them and collapse on him, and then he would kick it out to the three-point shooters and then they will hit. So I think that they have to guard the perimeter more and just guard Giannis. And Siakam just has to guard Giannis how he was in the first half. And I would let them shoot, though. Mm -hmm. I like I like them shooting, I know. but if you but I broad, like, Yeah, broad, and you can't let him shoot. I let He's a good Lopez, outside shooter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I think Danny Green has to step up, too, he because was he was yeah. dribbling yeah. off his foot. Um, Siakam played OK, but like he didn't have his do better. great game. He has to do better. Mm -hmm. But Kyle Lowry just has to play how he was in Kawhi. Wasn't surprised that he played good. So mm -hmm. yeah, he, he Kawhi just needs more help. So oh, yeah. with it's the, good with, that Kyle Lowry. With the Greek freak doing bad in the first game, I don't think that's how he's gonna be doing yeah. the whole series. So. I think he's gonna. That was just like that was our night. Like we we could have won. Cool. But I f we're, we're, I'm confident we can win. Yeah. Like, as long as we, Kawhi shows up and hopefully Lowry plays the same way. Mm -hmm. So I feel like we have a chance. I think so too. Yeah, oh, I think so too, for sure. Thank so you. what's your what's your call on this series? Like, it, it all the I Raptors, feel. but when? In game five, game six, game seven? Or I think it's gonna go game six. Game six? Where yeah. is game it, six. Where is, um, Ra Raptors are gonna, they're gonna win the next two games. Yeah. And then the Bucks are gonna pick it up they're gonna make it go to a game six. Yeah. Yeah, they just, well, Milwaukee is a very good team and Raptors too, but like, I feel like it might go to game seven mm -hmm. because of how both, because the, 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 they're both very good teams, like all around teams. But yeah, I think it might go to game seven. Mm -hmm. I feel with them. I, uh, yeah, I agree, I agree with seven. you, the mouse. What's your call? Game seven I'm calling game seven, I'm calling game seven. I saw call Kawhi doing the same shot. <laughs> now, my biggest question for you guys, yeah. let's say, you know, Raps do make it to the finals, Golden State does make it to the finals. Who are you guys cheering on? I know you're a fan I of... Have one, I have one thing to say. He's still okay, going to cheer. Go. Even this, at the Raptors. Who are you going to cheer for? If, Raptors if it's ever to or happen, no, what do you think? Warriors. Warriors. Raptors. So, so you guys are going to have a fight during this. Uh, this if, they, if we do make it. I want to see Come this Come back happen. on the show. Come back when we do <laughs> have a Raptors <laughs> and Golden I'll, State. Wear, I'll, I'll wear a uh, Raptors jersey yeah. and a Golden State and then, jersey. And switch up after. If Steph Curry scores, I'll take it off. I love Curry. I love Golden State. But I just have to go for... Our town. Yeah, hometown. Yeah. Hometown. 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 Awesome. Yeah. If it was, Let's if go it, Warriors. Say, <laughs> Let's go. Say it. It's Milwaukee and Golden State. I'm going with Golden State all the way. But yeah. okay, but I, I agree. It's gonna, I have it's confidence gonna be that too. it's going to be Ra Raptors yeah. and Golden State. If they make State. it, then Kawhi yeah. has to say. He I totally agree to. with you guys. Totally agree. Agree. Because they yeah. haven't won a championship. Yeah. yeah. It would so be nice to make it, it to be, the finals. Yeah. It would be um it would be good for the Raptors. I agree. Yeah. Well that's all we have guys for our segment. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We're our guests and with Ingrid and with myself as well. Any before we end it off, any last words for you guys you wanna shout out to your friends, family, to your team right there on the camera, right? Uh <laughs> Anything. Where can they find you guys shout on Instagram? To, shout out to Quincy Buckets. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Shout out to Bentley. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Bentley. Um, yeah. And where can they find you skills. guys on Instagram? Right here. Uh, follow oh. me, Zach underscore Balm30. Yeah. Follow me, Air underscore Miles underscore one. 
Awesome. Ingrid, any last words to our audience before we end it off? Uh, be sure to follow us on Filipinos and Basketball. Uh, check us out on YouTube every Sunday and Monday. Awesome. Out of that, guys, cool. stay balling, everybody. <laughs>